As a first time mum, I really didn't have any initial concerns about Teddy's health um, until our paediatrician started to flag something. So we'd just gone in for a checkup regarding something very small and she said oh like I don't think he's holding his head up as well as he should be for four months. We also noticed that he had a cross eye but that's quite common with newborns but she obviously considered that cross eye and then the head control and thought we needed more testing so she sent him for an MRI and genetic testing. We got the results when he had just turned five months old and the results said that he was missing a chunk of genes on chromosome 3. So the impact of the missing genes, we were told that they would uh, affect him mentally, physically, and particularly muscle tone. So he wouldn't, he may or may not be able to walk properly as well. I felt kind of overwhelmed at first. It took me a while to realize the gravity of it all. And then as he progressed in age, kind of every, every milestone he missed really hit me in a different way. You hit the hard times, but you just need to keep rolling through it for them. I didn't plan to have a child with a disability, but it happened and like you just love your kids, so it doesn't really matter, like you love them anyway, and he's very easy to love. Walking into Children's Medical Research Institute for the first time was really eye-opening to see the research that they're doing for Teddy's uh, genetic disorder. They took the time out of their day to chat with us and meet the first child that they've they might ever meet with CTNMV1 syndrome. So nice to hear their own words on the progress of the research and how incredibly close we are to potentially finding a breakthrough and really being able to like edit Teddy's DNA and give him a better chance at life. It's, yeah, it's unbelievable to think that potentially, even if it has a small impact on making life a little bit easier for him, that would just be so awesome. Yeah. Meeting the researchers was incredible to meet someone so smart and you know, knowing that our child's genetic disorder might be cured by this guy. It's like meeting a, a, a rocket scientist, but you know, for genetics, so it's incredible. <laughs> Superhero.